This year is shaping up to be a challenging one for investors. With the stock market's direction uncertain due to factors like high interest rates and persistent inflation. As the infamous Oracle of Omaha, Warren Buffett, once said, the most important rule of investing is to never lose money. That's why it's important to prepare for the worst while hoping for the best. In this video, we'll explore the world of dividend ETFs, which can help you navigate through an uncertain investing landscape. We'll also provide tips on how to choose dividend ETFs, and show you guys the top 7 ones out there. As we dive into the top 7 dividend ETFs, you'll learn how to navigate the rough waters of investing and keep your portfolio afloat, even in the stormiest of markets. Hello everyone, welcome to Lion Investors in this video. We will go through the top 7 dividend ETF options to invest in 2023. But before we begin, we would like you guys to subscribe to the channel, like this video, and hit the notification bell icon so you do not miss out on amazing and entertaining content. We begin to list down our top 7 picks for the best dividend ETF, it is preliminary to define what ETF is. The ETF, short for Exchange Traded Funds, was born during the stock market boom of the 1980s. Essentially, ETFs are bundles of assets that you can buy and sell on an exchange. Although it took a little while for the concept to catch on, ETFs have since exploded in popularity. It's hard to believe that there were only 276 ETFs in 2003, but in less than 20 years, that number skyrocketed by over 3,000% to an impressive 8,552 in 2021. This meteoric rise is a testament to just how useful and in-demand ETFs have become in the investment world. But with so many options out there, it can be overwhelming to choose the right one. Before making your selection, there are a few key factors you should consider. Firstly, take a close look at the expense ratio. This will give you an idea of the annual administrative costs that you will be charged for investing in the fund. The lower the expense ratio, the more investment returns will flow to your bottom line. Another crucial factor to consider is the dividend yield. This will give you an estimate of the income that the ETF is expected to generate. Make sure to evaluate the yield relative to the fund's risk level. Higher risk should produce higher yields, but they may be less reliable. Next, examine the dividend track record. Does the payout fluctuate frequently from quarter to quarter or month to month? Can you handle the potential income volatility? It's also important to analyze a fund's total return, which includes dividend income plus appreciation. While a high dividend yield is attractive, it's best analyzed in the context of total return. Finally, trading volume is a crucial indicator of market sentiment. Heavily traded ETFs are in demand, making them easier to sell. With so many great options out there, you won't be able to invest in all of them. To make things easier, here are the top 7 best dividend ETFs that you should look into first. 1. JP Morgan Diversified Return International Equity ETF the first option on our list is truly a hidden gem in the world of high dividend yield ETFs, JPIN. While it may not be marketed specifically as a dividend ETF, it boasts an impressive yield to expense ratio that easily puts it at our list. What makes JPIN stand out is its diverse portfolio of companies from around the world. With 30% of its holdings based in Japan and another 20% coming from the UK, JPIN also includes companies from Australia, South Korea, Hong Kong, France, Sweden, Germany, and many other countries. But here's the real kicker. JPIN's average annual dividend yield is a jaw-dropping 3.44%, and its expense ratio is a mere 0.37%. 2. Vanguard High Dividend Yield ETF Vanguard is well known for offering low-cost ETFs that are highly diversified and the Vanguard High Dividend Yield ETF is no exception. This ETF tracks the FTSE High Dividend Yield Index, which currently includes more than 400 large-cap U.S. stocks that have been screened for high yields. The VYM offers a dividend investing approach through a dividend exchange-traded fund, which only goes after those stocks with the highest dividend payouts. This is why the ETF is composed of a diverse group of 446 large-cap U.S. stocks, which are spread across all 11 stock market sectors. In terms of sector dominance, the VYM has a slight dominance of assets in the healthcare and financial services sectors, with top holdings in companies like JP Morgan, Johnson & Johnson, and Procter & Gamble. The ETF's market capitalization is high, and it has low volatility, which makes it a good choice for investors who prefer a low-risk investment. One of the biggest advantages of investing in VYM is the expense ratio, which is a meager 0.06%. This means that for every $10,000 invested in the ETF, you'll only pay $6 in annual fees. While the annual dividend yield for VYM is 3.09%, the low expense ratio makes it an attractive option for those looking to reduce their investment costs. Overall, the Vanguard High Dividend Yield ETF is a good option for investors looking for a low-cost, diversified ETF that offers a dividend investing approach. 3. iShares International Development Property ETF If you're looking to invest in real estate but want to diversify your portfolio with low-cost international options, 
the WPS may be a good choice for you. This ETF invests in a variety of publicly traded real estate investment firms located outside of the United States, offering exposure to industrial, retail, and residential properties. While the majority of the assets are located in Japan, there are also significant holdings in Australia and Hong Kong. One of the biggest draws of the WPS is its high average annual dividend yield of 4.42%, making it one of the highest on the list. However, it's important to note that the expense ratio is also higher compared to other ETFs on this list, sitting at 0.48%. This means you'll pay more for your dividends than with some other options, so it's important to consider the overall cost-benefit analysis before making a decision. But if you're willing to pay a little more in fees, the WPS can provide a great way to diversify your portfolio and invest in global real estate without breaking the bank. With a wide range of holdings in different sectors and locations, this ETF can provide a level of stability and growth potential that may be hard to find elsewhere. 4. Schwab US Dividend Equity ETF The SCHD is a top choice for investors seeking a dividend ETF that tracks the Dow Jones US Dividend 100 Index. This ETF focuses on the quality and sustainability of dividends, along with strong financial ratios and boasts some prized holdings, including Texas Instruments, Pepsi, and Home Depot. While the SCHD has a less diversified portfolio with only 104 stocks, the low price-to-earnings and price-to-book ratio provide excellent exposure to value stocks. The annual dividend value for SCHD is 3.61%, and the expense ratio matches the VYM at 0.06%. The only downside is the lack of diversification. However, from a pure profit margin standpoint, the SCHD is a very lucrative option. The fund's turnover of assets is a comfortable 14%, and it costs an expense ratio of 0.06%, comparable to Vanguard's low rates. 5. ProShares S&P 500 Dividend Aristocrats ETF ProShares, a well-known provider of leveraged ETFs, also offers a hidden gem in the form of NOBL. This ETF focuses on the 64 current dividend aristocrat stocks in the S&P 500, which are companies that have consistently paid and grown dividends for at least 25 consecutive years. The portfolio is relatively well-balanced, providing investors with exposure to a wide variety of these high-quality companies. This approach has helped NOBL reduce volatility and downside risk during market turbulence, making it a popular choice for investors looking for stability in their portfolios. 6. Arbor Dividend Growth Leaders ETFs are commonly associated with passive indexes, but there is a growing number of actively managed options in the space. And one of the best ones out there is Harbor Dividend Growth Leaders, an actively managed ETF that has been ranked 5 stars by Morningstar. With a focused universe of only 40 holdings, this ETF takes targeted bets that have paid off well in the long run, with 3-year returns of 9.42% and 5-year returns of 12.26%. While there are other impressive options, such as the Cambria Shareholder Yield ETF, Harbor stands out for its impressive scores in capital preservation, making it a good choice for investors looking for stability in their portfolios. Additionally, its slightly lower management fees of 0.5% compared to 0.59% for Cambria shareholder yield ETF is another plus. Although the expense ratio might give some investors pause, the cost might be worth it for those who prefer the maneuverability of active management during volatile markets. 7. SPDR Portfolio S&P 500 High Dividend ETF Investors who prefer to focus on high-yielding dividend stocks in the S&P 500 can consider investing in SPY, an ETF that tracks the S&P 500 High Dividend Index. With only 80 holdings, SPY deviates significantly from the usual top sectors of the regular S&P 500 index, such as technology, healthcare, and communication services. Instead, it gives higher weightage to dividend-paying sectors like real estate, financials, utilities, materials, and consumer staples at 21%, 17%, 14%, 8%, and 8% respectively. This results in a different risk return profile compared to the regular S&P 500 index. SPYD is currently priced at a low expense ratio of 0.07% with a whopping 4.53% annual dividend yield. It can be a suitable option for investors seeking high dividend yields while keeping the expenses low. And that concludes our rundown of the top 7 dividend ETFs to invest in 2023. Remember, investing in the stock market can be a wild ride, especially in uncertain times like these. But by choosing the right dividend ETFs, you can stay calm and confident through market turbulence. Don't forget to do your own research and due diligence before making any investment decisions. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more investing insights.